NOON, INVESTIGATORS WERE BACK AT THE ELEMENTARY SCHOOL IN TEXAS THIS MORNING AS FAMILIES OF THE 19 CHILDREN KILLED IN THE HORRIFIC ATTACK PREPARE TO PLAN THEIR FUNERALS. THE ENTIRE COMMUNITY IN MOURNING AND COMING TOGETHER TO SHOW THEIR SUPPORT FOR THE VICTIMS AND THEIR FAMILIES WITH PRAYER CIRCLES HELD. WE'RE LIVE ON AIR AND ARE WE STREAMING ON CBS NEWS MIAMI WITH THE CBS NEWS APP. GOOD AFTERNOON. I'M NICOLE LAUREN. NOW THE DAY AFTER ONE OF THE DEADLIEST SCHOOL SHOOTINGS IN U.S. HISTORY, PEOPLE EVERYWHERE ARE ASKING WHY IT HAPPENED AGAIN AND WHAT CAN BE DONE TO STOP THE CARNAGE. CBS 4'S ERIN JONES IS IN UVALDE, TEXAS WITH THE LATEST. SADNESS AND GRIEF OVERWHELM UVALDE, TEXAS AND THE NATION FOLLOWING ANOTHER MASS SHOOTING. AN 18-YEAR-OLD GUNMAN BARGED INTO AN ELEMENTARY SCHOOL TUESDAY WITH AN ASSAULT-STYLE RIFLE AND HIGH-CAPACITY MAGAZINES. It just started shooting children and teachers that were inside that classroom, having no regard for human life, just a complete tragedy. Authorities say the gunman shot and wounded his grandmother before the school rampage. They are investigating what led up to the massacre. No friends, no girlfriends at this time that we know of was unemployed, no criminal history, no gang affiliation. So we're trying to determine exactly what the motive was. At least 21 people, including 19 young children, died. In an address to the nation last night, President Biden called on lawmakers to take action. Why do we keep letting this happen? Where in God's name is our backbone to have the courage to deal with it and stand up to the lobbies? It's time to turn this pain into action. Some parents waited all night here at the Civic Center to see if their child survived the massacre. Authorities even using DNA samples to try and identify some of the victims. Uh, my daughter, Ann Annabelle Guadalupe Rodriguez. Her name, uh, she's only 10 years old. Jesse Rodriguez eventually got word his daughter was one of the victims. As this community learns more about who was killed inside the school, they are grappling with a sudden and unbearable loss.